babes welcome and welcome back to my channel thank you so much for clicking on this video as always i really appreciate it my name is rhoda minor each and every one of you is welcome here today we are speaking about confidence do you have confidence do you want to attain that confidence that's what we are going to be dwelling in on today's video so i hope you're going to enjoy it and also learn and i'm thinking that you guys need a notebook so that you can note down all these points that i'm about to tell you so without further ado let's just get right into it you might be seated there you've lost all hope and you feel like you don't have any confidence left this is just a reminder that you can do it i'm sure you have a rough understanding on what confidence is but confidence is being proud of who you are going for your goals whether small or big and actually doing it so that's basically what confidence is all about and here are some of the tips that i can actually give you so that you can boost up your confidence plan yourself you've set some goals go for them it's time for you to go for your goals whether it's big or small and when you achieve it celebrate it whether it's a small one or a big one a win is a win and everything is worth celebrating we're in this life life is short and the little things that you achieve each and every day each and every every minute make sure that you celebrate it that will make you confident and make you plan more plan yourself nicely so that you can also see and feel that you can actually go for the bigger and much greater goals that you've set babes make sure you monitor your progress those goals that you've written break them into smaller and then greater and greater goals so that by the end of the day you can be able to tick what goal you are able to achieve during that uh, hour that you had set out that day that you'd set out for it i would advise you to get a planner because a planner helps you write down the goals that you want to achieve on that day or even on that hour or that whole week and once you do that you write all down make sure by the end of the day you tick each and every goal that you are able to achieve and make it accustomed to you so that it can feel like it's something that you need to tick by the end of the day so it will push you to actually do these things and eventually you're going to see that you're actually progressing step by step until you get to your goals think about your future you're not only making goals for that day you're making and thinking about what you want to achieve long term we don't just make short-term goals by the way make sure you also know what you want to achieve after a while after five years after two years so that you can put your focus in what that goal will entail everything that it will like bring forth because along the way babe there are some bumpy roads there's something that affects you there's something that will bring you down but how well you choose to handle that problem that's going to make sure that your confidence is on point and that's what we all want to achieve because at the back of our minds we want to achieve something but how well can you handle all those challenges that come along so make sure you plan for your future you think about your future not only for that day so that you can actually realize and know the ways that you're going to make that happen those goals make sure you follow through them you've written down you've planned them you've done everything now follow through each and every one of them because that will just make you see that you're going for your goals and also you're achieving them today i've ticked down what i've been able to achieve at this hour i wrote this down to achieve it this time i was able to achieve it then why not just follow through each goal by the end of the day you take down everything by the end of the month you say that i was able to achieve this throughout this month by the end of the year have a vision board have something that will put you and just keep you motivated because that's just the simplest way that you can build yourself up and you'll realize that you're actually achieving those goals that you had written and that will make you confident don't care about what other people think there's a song that reminds me when your words mean nothing i go la 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 you close your ears to whatever issue whatever problem that other person might be telling you that you have close your ears to it baby listen to whatever your heart wants control your mind make sure you don't listen to people that they bring you down and you accept them to bring you down no 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 it doesn't work like that and it shouldn't work like that 
because you have it written down you have it in your head that you want to achieve this and this and do you think when you listen to other people by how they are underestimating you you will even go anywhere you will move anywhere no babe you have to just plan it and don't listen to these people that try and bring you down imagine they're the ones with the problem but don't listen to them cut them off i've already told you cut them off if they're bringing you down babe try as much as possible to block their words to block whatever they advise you because they just don't want to see you succeed so babe block each and everything that is negative around you block it do what you want and focus on it that's the next step make sure whatever you've written down you actually want to get them to achieve them so make sure you focus your mind everything invest on it because the much more you focus on something that's the much more it even succeeds so make sure you focus on that goal that you've written down in your planner that you want to achieve by the end of the year make sure you focus on it put so much time on it and it will eventually succeed do what makes you happy do what makes you smile everybody is watching anyway you're only here for a while i don't want a copyright strike but baby you need to do what makes you happy do what makes you smile because this life is short and if you try and impress everyone baby you won't make it you won't build your confidence so why don't you just focus on yourself and what you want because that will make you achieve will make you see that i'm actually going for my goals and i'm trying my best looking for ways to make it happen so why don't you just know what you want and go for it because there's nothing holding you back try as much as possible to cut off all those things that are negative that bring you down that make you feel that you can't achieve this because those ones will be the ones that will limit you from your goal and will make you scare, will make your self-esteem go down. Stand up for yourself. Know how to stand up for yourself. If someone brings you down, do not listen to them. They have no time to be even around you. Try as much as possible to cut off such people because those people will make your confidence go down. You won't boost it. You will feel like all those plans and goals that you've set out won't actually work. These people are telling me that it can't work. Then why should it work in my brain? So make sure you stand up for yourself. Avoid such people. Avoid such incidences by cutting off some people, cutting off some things that make you go down, make you just underestimate yourself. Be fearless. Fear comes from within. And if you tell your mind that you can't do this, you won't actually do it. Your mind controls everything. If it's friends that you get motivation from, if it's YouTube videos that you need to watch, if it's a podcast that you need to listen to, make sure you listen to each and every thing. But make sure that your fear is out of the way. Kick it out of the door because it needs to go. It needs to live for you to achieve those goals. Then why not tell yourself that you can achieve that goal? Why not? Do it, babe, and you will see that you will actually grow and build your confidence more and more. You've already planned your goals. You've written them down. Then what's making you not go for them? Be proud of who you are, what you are. Remember, you can't change how you look or anything, but you can change how you think. You can change and improve yourself in so many ways, in so many aspects. So make sure you try as much as possible to make confidence be something that you want to achieve this year, to be something that you want to achieve today, to be something that you want to learn about and know and hack it, you know. Build each other up, boost other people's confidence. You might need someone later on that will build you up, that will boost your confidence up. So feel free to also help those people you see that are really just unconfident by giving them good advice, by telling them that they can do it. Don't be that bad person we are saying that we need to cut off. Be someone that can actually help other people to achieve their goals by just that little word that you can do it. Trust me, it takes time, but you will get through it, babe. You will know how to manage it, how to learn it, how to just be confident so don't be disappointed if you're not confident just learn and take these simple steps simple tips 
and in the long run you'll see that i'm actually progressing i'm moving from point a to point b and you'll become a better version of yourself of course you don't achieve something immediately you go it adds up each and every time and that is progress you need progress so that you can be confident to succeed so make sure you plan little by little it will make it till the end and you will just end up being confident and more successful then so go for your goals i hope this video was something that made you learn a few or just one of the tips that you can be able to use so that you can boost up your confidence your self-esteem because confidence is something that we all need daily and we need to just learn ways to hack it so thank you so much guys for watching i'm hoping and wishing that you become a better version of yourself you try as much as possible to improve on everything that you have i'm sending you some love light and peace throughout these times and i'm hoping and wishing the best for each and every one of you until next time bye babes